let's review Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness. You guys want to see the coolest thing ever? Not the coolest thing ever, I was just kidding. Um, so... This review is going to be a mixed bunch for you guys. I know this is a very mixed movie. But I got Doctor Strange on DVD. I just thought I'd show you guys, because it's actually... Um, you know what? I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna cut to the chase. Let's get to the movie. When I first heard that Sam Raimi was gonna be dick, um directing a Doctor Strange movie, I was all up for that, okay? And then when I saw the trailer for this movie, holy shit. I was so fucking pumped. So when I went to um, see this movie in theaters, did it live up to the expectations? <laughs> a lot of people were let down on this movie. I, sorry, ugh, I can't talk. Oh my God, what the fuck did I just say? A lot of people were disappointed with this movie, but guys, why? This movie was amazing. Okay, guys, I'm just gonna let I'm just gonna let you know. I love this movie. I straight up just fucking love it. Okay, I wasn't a huge fan of the first Doctor Strange, but this specific movie, and I think it's just because of the horror vibe, made me like Doctor Strange a hundred times more than his previous um, appearances in the MCU. Um. Now, I can understand why some people can just were just disappointed, um, I guess. I can see why. Um, all I got to say is this movie could have been a lot better, though. If they just said, Sam, do whatever you want with this movie. Here, it's your movie. Just do it. He would have went all out for this. I just imagine this being rated R. Like, I'm surprised some of this was in a PG-13 movie. I, I, I don't think it needs specifically be made for a rated R but I also think that like a lot of stuff was pushing it <laughs> oh my god this movie is dark and gritty I absolutely fucking dug the hell out of this movie I remember me and my friend were just like, clapping in the theater when we watched this oh man this movie was just so good so freaking good <sighs> so I love the inclusion of America Chavez. Great actress, um, great casting pick. She brings so much energy. Everyone in this movie just brings so much energy to the, their roles. And Scarlet Witch as a villain. Now, I will admit that's the flaw of the movie in my opinion, is her. I feel like she was totally misused. Even though she was a great villain, I just think some of her dialogue was pretty bad and how her acting was it was pretty iffy and i i was like elizabeth come on you can do a little bit better than that but i don't i don't know if it's that or if it's just the the script or the dialogue because i do have issues with some of the dialogue in this movie but however multiverse of badness everyone says it didn't live up to its name it did though it did because here's the thing he goes through different multiverses the visuals in here are absolutely insane like some of the best visuals you cannot you cannot tell me that this movie has some of the best visuals of the mcu period because i will die on a hill for that i will seriously i will disagree with you if you say this is not the best visual visual styled movie in the mcu i highly highly disagree with you now I just like the tone of the movie. It's it's horror aspect, like zombie strange, there's different variations. It explores the multiverse. It's not necessarily a multiverse of madness, but it's also it's it's like starting to bring the multiverse into the MCU because remember, there was the Infinity Saga, right? Which is phase one through three I believe and then there was phase four which is the start of the multiverse saga and I just feel like this movie started like oh hey this is how the multiverse is going to work in the MCU and I think honestly guys the variants the characters freaking amazing phenomenal honestly fucking oh my god Captain Carter is in this movie okay so spoiler review here um 
the Illuminati, okay? They, sh they should have went all out with that. So that's another one of my disappointments. I did like the Illuminati in this movie, though. <laughs> and I know a lot of people hated that they were, like, killed off within the first fucking five minutes. But I enjoyed the living shit out of that. I feel like this movie took the balls to just kill off characters so fast. And holy shit, I was so shocked that the MCU had the balls to do that. No MCU movie has ever done that. Killed almost half a fucking team. <laughs> oh my god. What? Like, this movie was absolutely insane. Okay, like, the visuals are top notch. Um, I absolutely enjoyed this movie. This is a hell of a time movie. If you sit through it, enjoy it, turn off your brain for a while, this is a fucking amazing movie. And I enjoyed it a lot more than other people did. And I don't think that's just because of my theater experience. I just think it's just, it's my style. And it's a different kind of MCU movie. Um, Garganthos, I think his name is, with the, the big eye, I, I think that's his name. Don't quote me. But wasn't really a character. Did have a Lego set. However, I still like that. Like the creature um, flick type vibe you get in the first, like, I don't know, 10 minutes of this movie is awesome. The magic, the, the, the Doctor Strange magic, it's awesome. The visuals are amazing. Now, some people say that the CGI is a little wonky and it's bad. Guys, it's not. I Honestly, I can't think of a single thing in here that has bad CGI. Not as bad as She-Hole. No way. No way you could tell me that. This movie was such a blessing to fucking have. Guys, I oh, I don't understand why people said, oh, this is, didn't live up to it. And yeah, I can understand the dialogue isn't there, and some scenes are like, I don't know, a little bit cringy. Guys, come on. You're giving it too much shit, and you're just finding something to complain about. I absolutely adore this movie. Benedict Cumberbatch's performance is one of his best, I'd have to say, especially at the end with a zombie strange. Holy shit, the inclusion of America Chavez has it like a new kind of flavor for an MCU movie. Exploring the multiverse is such a cool concept in this movie, and I feel like it was executed off really well. Oh. If we're talking about bad CGI moments, the eye, yeah, all of it, that's pretty bad. That's it, though. Otherwise, guys, this movie's amazing. CGI is great. Um, I heard that they were supposed to have a lot more Illuminati characters, so I missed out. I, 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 it sucks that we missed out on fucking Ghost Rider, which I am the most disappointed about. 100%. We missed out on Tom Cruise's. Now, I'm not a huge fan of Tom Cruise, but his Iron Man. The Superior Iron Man? Imagine if that shit was in this movie. Ghost Rider? Fucking... Oh my god. That would be insane. But I... With the movie that we have... We're kind of lucky we got it. Honestly. John Kwasinski is Mr. Fantastic. What are you... Why are you guys complaining? He... That's fan cast. That's fan service right there. I don't know. I absolutely adore this movie. I'm going to give it a golden TV, guys. You're... You, I... You, you guys might think I'm giving it too much credit, but this is my opinion. I adore this movie. I don't think there's barely any flaws. This is a not a top five um, MCU movie, but a top ten for me. Because honestly, I just love the horror vibe and I love the visuals. It's such a good story and concept, and it's, in my opinion, executed off very well. So I'm going to give it the golden TV. However, like I said, it's not top notch, so I'm going to give it like a 23%. On the golden tv but it's still our second movie on this channel that has earned the golden tv so guys that is my review for doctor strange multiverse of madness i got batwoman season two and three review coming soon um i'm probably going to be posting some tonight i might don't quote me because it's a blizzard tonight i might be doing a live stream with all my funko pops tonight i don't know for sure but if so stay tuned and guys if you'd like to follow me on other, any other social media platforms i got instagram and tiktok um can't put the link in the descriptions but if you can look me up i'm sure you'll find it because my name is pretty damn rare so um good luck with that guys and i'll see you on the next one peace